meteorologist Mark Mulner is your host for the Weather Show, Weather Northeastern. We're going to get right into your Thanksgiving weather outlook. Before we do, I do have some photos to send in here. They're actually mine from Media Mark Weather Studio across portions of Northeast Pennsylvania and upstate New York. Take a look at the kind of snow that fell about 20 inches here at the studio. Really topping up here as far as overperforming snowfall forecasts here. Forecasts had us anywhere from 3 to 10 inches of snow and we outperformed with 20 inches and it was a widespread event that occurred across the general area from the southern tier of the upper Susquehanna region of upstate New York and northeast Pennsylvania. Portions of Broome, Tioga, portions of Shenango, Tompkins, as well as northeast Pennsylvania's Susquehanna, northern Wayne counties. Seeing this type of snow and you can see how it drifted across the area in this photo here. Let's get right into the forecast before we do. Well, starting off with your Thanksgiving outlook here. Not too bad here across the western United States. We will have some problems, though, here in the central portion of the country. But the big problem spot, even though it will be light precipitation, a wintry mix of snow, sleet, and freezing rain here across upstate New York, northern Pennsylvania, the Catskills, Poconos, Adirondacks, and portions of New England as well, which could pose serious problems here. Even though it will be light precipitation, it only takes a tenth of an inch or less of freezing rain to cause major travel problems. So watch out for that here in the Northeast, icing a distinct possibility with the system moving in. Let's take a look at the forecast, starting off with the precipitation totals across the country. As I said, we've got that problem here up here. It will be light precipitation, but as I said, frozen precipitation only takes a little bit. Here in the central portion, that's where a lion's share, and here in two portions of the Pacific Northwest, as you can see the jet stream forming here. we got that really double jet stream here for this time of year. Take a look here, trough, Pacific Northwest, portions of the Northeast as well. we got that trough digging here as well. Take a look at the forecast, starting off with your snowfall amounts across the Northeast. As you can see, snowfall will be on the light side, mostly an inch or less, some two to three, maybe four inches up here in the Adirondacks and White Mountains in the southern Quebec and Ontario. But take a look at the freezing precipitation, freezing rain sleet map, mainly freezing rain. We could get that tenth of an inch here Wednesday night into Thanksgiving morning here across upstate New York, the upper Susquehanna River Valley, northeast Pennsylvania, the Catskills, Poconos up into portions of New England here later in the day. We'll watch for that, starting off with your Wednesday here, big travel day across the Northeast. We're not looking too bad to say the least, but right off the screen is that next system. So we do warm it into the mid to upper 30s, some near 40 degree temperatures. But here is your Thanksgiving Day forecast. Low pressure moves across the Pennsylvania Turnpike north of this warm front and low pressure system. That's where we'll get that light wintry precipitation here across the Catskills, Poconos, portions of the upper Susquehanna River Valley towards the Allegheny River Valley and extending all the way up towards the Adirondacks, White Mountains, and even into southern Canada here. Only takes about a tenth to a quarter inch of ice to cause some problems and that will be a problem with this wintry mix into your Friday. Big shopping day here across the Northeast. Look at this. We're still dealing with somewhat of a system. Most of the moisture trapped up here across the Eastern Lakes, Northern Mountains. But as I said, this day we'll have the temperatures moderate a little bit into the upper 30s, lower 40s. So it'll be marginal for accumulation of snow and ice. We'll still have that dreary effects of this low pressure into Saturday, as well as you can see here into Sunday. Take a look at that. We've got systems here across the Northeast into your weekend. And we're pretty much socked in with, you know, that scattered shower, drizzle fog, snowflakes mixing in for your Saturday. And of course, that'll continue on into Sunday as well. Let's take a look at the 10 day four, or five day forecast here in 10 seconds from my hometown viewers in Binghamton, Scranton's upper Susquehanna region of upstate New York and Northeast Pennsylvania. Don't forget to like me on Facebook and Media Mark. Subscribe to me on YouTube and Media Mark Comments, Twitter, WX Northeastern, Google Plus and Media Mark. Here's your five days, starting off with your Wednesday all the way through Sunday. Take a look. Wednesday, not too bad if you got a travel day. Mostly roads should be clear by then, but look at this. Wednesday night into Thursday, you get that tenth of an inch of possible freezing rain with sleet, changing over, you know, mixture of snow, sleet, freezing rain, maybe over to rain by afternoon. But the damage will be done by Thanksgiving morning. If you have to travel, it's not going to be that great. It'll be light, 
but freezing rain, even light, is bad into your Friday. We'll still have that chance of light wintry precipitation around. It won't accumulate much. We head up towards 40 into Saturday and Sunday. We get maybe a little bit of clearing, but not much to say the least. That's going to do it for this edition of Weather Northeastern.